Hey guys, what up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Alif and today video, I want to talk about what's new inside Vegas Pro 18, Vegas FX and Vegas Image software and all of these three software under the Vegas Post Suite package. And of course, I have list out what's new in Vegas Pro 18 as well as the other two program, but I will highlight more on the Vegas Pro 18 because that's the main editing program for a Vegas creative software. All right, so the first new stuff in Vegas Pro 18 is the new dedicated motion tracking panel. Now with this new dedicated panel, user are no longer need to use the bezel mask to motion track. And the best of all, you are no longer need to use script to send the tracking data to picture in picture. And from this same dedicated panel, you can send the tracking data directly from there and send to any effects in Vegas Pro that contains location and position. So for example, if you want to motion track a lens flare effects in Vegas Pro, it's possible to use the new dedicated motion tracking panel, which is really great. Next, what's new in Vegas Pro 18 that's now come along with another program, which is Soundforge Pro 14. So basically from Vegas Pro 18, you can send your audio to Soundforge to do more advanced audio editing with that program which is really nice so if you purchase vegas pro 18 or vegas post suite you will get soundforge pro 14 uh, together with the uh, software you buy vegas pro 18 now have ai technology inside the software and with ai you can recolor black and white footage which is pretty crazy and i'm pretty sure it can do more than just recoloring black and white footage so i'm hoping to see more ai stuff in the future of Vegas Pro software. Vegas Pro 18 now have a new video scope which they added the skin tone lines inside the vector scope as well a combined version of RGB for the RGB parade so you can basically uh, color correct and color grade your video precisely with the updated video scopes inside Vegas Pro 18. Vegas Pro 18 now have a new uh, docking panel design so all of the effects are now organized inside its own tab so for example if you want a color effect you just simply hit the color tab and all of the color effects that you're looking for will be displayed inside the tab so it will increase your editing speed which is really nice to see this new update on the user interface of the docking panel. Another new stuff in Vegas Pro 18 is uh, new denoiser effects which you can reduce the amount of noise in your video clip and also flickery uh, removal effects which you can also get rid or reduce the amount of flicker in your footage which I found that to be very useful plugins that come along inside the software itself. They also added more than 20 uh, modern animations for the titles and text so you can now have a modern slick uh, titles and animations in uh, your video just by using the animations preset that built in inside the uh, titles and text which is really nice. Also in the website they say they will be releasing another program called the Vegas Prepare which will organize all of your media or your projects uh, when you're editing inside Vegas Pro software. So I'm really looking forward to see that and probably this might be a game changer because when I'm doing editing with Vegas Pro, all of the media are pretty much here and there. It's kind of messy here and there. So maybe with Vegas Prepare, it will organize all of the media nicely for me so I can archive it for future use. So I'm really um, looking forward to see Vegas Prepare software. All right, so I think I covered enough for Vegas Pro 18. There's a lot more actually if I want to uh, highlight the new stuff here in Vegas Pro 18. But let's move on to the other uh, program. So let's start off with Vegas Effects. So what's new in Vegas Effects this time is that they add more uh, custom mask shape uh, inside the program so back then it was limited to super basic shapes so now it add uh, more shapes like stars and polygons and actually a few more other shapes which is I can't recall what it is so uh, user now able to do more advanced motion graphics with Vegas effects and then they added a new effects called the auto stabilizer which it will analyze your footage and stabilize 
the video and from the same effects uh, instead of uh, stabilizing the video it will create a point and from that point you can actually extract to become a motion tracking point so it will create a new point layer and from that point you can parent it to the other um, media in the timeline like text uh, videos or any 3d elements if you want to motion track it to your video which is really great all right so let's move on to vegas image software it's a photo editing program and what's new in vegas image is now they add the split tone effects it's very similar to split toning inside a lightroom and you can do the same stuff here in vegas image and i use split toning a lot and that's great because now i can do the same uh, split toning effects here in Vegas image. Next they have the new denoiser effects which you can get rid or reduce the amount of noise in your photos. They also have a brush mask effects or tools I would say which you can quickly brush your image and mask it in the same time which is really great. And there's a lot of uh, new stuff here in Vegas and Vegas image it's just that I'm not really familiar with the program so I'm not really sure what's the other new stuff here in Vegas effects and Vegas image and also I rarely do tutorials for both Vegas effects and Vegas image but I will make a tutorial for these two program along with Vegas Pro 18 so stay tuned on my channel for more tutorial for Vegas post suite software so I hope you guys enjoy uh, this video and if you have any question related you can just leave it down in the comment section and see you guys next time bye bye